Let me break it to you. If you don't change your equipment reservation workflow today, you are going to fail. And you're gonna get stuck in this crazy manual work forever. Within one year, you might go from this to this. Oh. Yeah, maybe you already have a process in place to check out equipment and you're incredibly <laughs> proud of it. But you don't actually have a system to let other people reserve that equipment. And this is why in this video, I will show you a three-step reservation system to book out your gear. And I will also show you something that's gonna blow your mind. Just... So, stick to the end. I am Osvaldo from Checkroom and let's go. The first step is knowing who needs what equipment. If you have a closed gear cage in a bigger company, then I really suggest that you use Google Forms. I made a video where I talk you through all the process on creating that perfect Google Form for your equipment reservation. Check it out here. All right, let's go to step number two. Once you have an overview of who is requesting what equipment, now you need to know if that equipment is available. And where to find this information? Well, if you're not using an equipment management software that keeps data on all of your gear, then you need an equipment inventory list. If you don't have a standard equipment list just yet, then make sure you check out this video where I show you how to do it. Now, you definitely want to make sure that you have columns for reservations. You need to be able to see who has booked the equipment and for how long. Once you have that, to know what gear is needed, you can click on the filtering option and search for the gear you need to book out. If you see it is free for that specific period of time, you can fill in the columns for the reservation. If not, then you can actually see if something similar may be available by filtering on the category level. If that's the case, then you might need a little bit of back and forth emailing to make sure you confirm and update the new equipment that's gonna be booked. Step number three, this last step, you need to confirm with your colleague or a student that the gear they requested is available and ready to be picked up. You can do it by using Google Calendar or Outlook Calendar, depends on the service that you use. Send a calendar invite to the person that's taking the gear. And in the description, you can add the gear that they're about to check out. That way, they're reminded of the checkout time and they also know exactly what was booked for them. Dear friends, I do have to say that this workflow has a major flaw. In fact, many flaws. For example, your producers, students, freelancers, they have no visibility on what's available. And whenever they request something that's not available, that triggers a cascade of different emails of you chasing them down to let them know that X equipment is not available and nothing is automated. You have to be chasing down people for hours and hours and you may want to think, ah, oh, I can't just give them access to that spreadsheet so they can check what's available. I guarantee it will get messy very, very soon. There is no accountability. They can change whatever field they want. All of a sudden, you no longer trust your spreadsheet. So you're left with handling all of that by yourself. But is that really what you want to do in life? Spend hours scheduling equipment for others, emailing back and forth, and chasing down missing equipment? No! no! This is why you should let a software do that manual work for you. In an equipment management software like Checkroom, you only need to do one single step and not from three to a hundred steps. You would just create a reservation, choose the loan out period, location and the equipment you want to book out and then you can immediately see what is available for those specific dates and what is the state of the equipment and the best part is that people that need to reserve equipment they can do it all by themselves and you choose what type of access they have and what exactly they can see and also check room can send them automatic reminders via email or text message about the due date checkout time or whatever you customize it for if you got curious about what an equipment management software can do for you, just click here, watch this video. Bye bye. One I will do just no, and then no, and then I'll do no. Is it recording? It's recording.